Why this one? I sailed all the way across the Iliad Bay, and I need a glass of grog. I shared a drink with some unsavory characters, but I draw the line at zombies. I think I'll stay off the docks for now. You can't smell their soggy, rotting flesh. Just walk down the causeway there. You'll see them. Damned army of them. Question is, why aren't the Sentinel Guards doing anything? Nah, I've seen a few of the bootless louts skulking around, behind crates and such. Someone needs to go grab one of the guards and ask what in oblivion's going on here. You up for it? There you go. Give the guards a kick and tell them to get to work. I've got cargo to unload. The guards can't help us look for the dockmaster. Maybe he's got half a brain. Unless the zombies have eaten it, of course. As if this day hadn't gone to oblivion already. You feel the need to remind me of all my debt? Yes, I still owe Sarashi. The Don Posset is a quality ship. It'll take time to pay her off. How do you think I make a living? I buy there, sell here. It's what I do. All legitimate, of course. Picked up a load of timber and wayrest. It'll sell for a pile of coin here. Better. Too many. I can't take it. You might want to get back on your boat, Seafarer. The dead are crawling from the sea and they have overtaken the docks. There is nothing to be done. We just have to pray to Tuwaka that they wander away. Zombies? Oh, such a crude term. These Ramnetu are the remains of sailors who shipwrecked off the coast. We respect our dead here in the Alakir Desert. Even those who died at sea are honored ancestors. We do not fight them. We would be cursed. No. You are an outsider. These are not your ancestors. And as such, there is no dishonor in striking them down. No curse. Oh, but the fact that the dead have risen at all... It is terrible. We have strict laws. This should not happen here. I do not know. And I fear we have only made the situation worse. We thought we could contain them. We built barricades and tried to herd them away, but... It was to no avail. Now, I fear, we are in even greater danger. My fellow guards will not strike the Ranatu either. Jessmine, Pierjean, and Emidal. I fear for their lives. Please find them and send them away. Then meet at the warehouse. The Dark Master hides there, and he may know the cause of all this. No! Go away! They're going to find me! I don't want to die! No, none of us are. The Ranitu are going to kill us all! It is not fair. I am too young to die. I just want to run. 
to run away. This Ronetu caught me. He was trying to bite me, to eat me. I tried to fend him off, but he jerked, and his head ran against my blade. It wasn't my fault. What am I going to do now? But what about stopping this Ronetu from getting into the city? What about the other guards? I cannot simply abandon them. Can I? Great Ruptka, if this be not your will, send me a sign. Wait, who are you? What are you doing here? Blood and honor. I have always had faith, but never have I. You are here to fight the Ronetu? Praised Ruptka, I was prepared to dishonor myself, but he sent you. I will go then. God be with you, my friend. Is the way... Finally, someone who's not afraid to do the dirty work. Someone to clean up my docks. I watched you from the window till I heard those necromancers downstairs. But I thought Mujad was coming here too. Did you see him? Damn. The poor bastard. I told them. I told the guards that they were going to have to fight back. It is one thing to be superstitious. But when the Ranetu are attacking the city, it's time to put the superstitions aside. No, we're not all so hung up on our beliefs. Can't ignore the tradition, though. Not unless we want fruit thrown at us, or worse. Regardless, right now I'm just glad Taba's wind guided you here. Someone to get the Ronetu off the damn docks. I do. I overheard the necromancers. Their leader is calling the dead from the sea with some kind of dark ritual. If you can disrupt the ritual, the dead should... Well, they should drop dead. Or at least stop crawling out of the water. That I do not know. I heard them mention a warehouse at the west end of the docks. 
Maybe the ritual is there. Wherever it is, you have to stop it. Then tell Captain Safira. Taba be with you. Rise again to serve me! The raw nets will have returned to the sea. The docks will soon smell of dead fish again instead of dead people. And you, right off the boat, and you slay the necromancer? Surely Tehuaca sent you to deliver us from this difficult situation. I am too. It has been many years since the plague of necromancy visited our shores. Though I am relieved the docks are clear, the events of this day are extremely disturbing. The plague of necromancy has truly returned. I fear the future may bring many dark days. Someone will need to come forward to fight the risen dead. The dead are sacred. It is what the people of Alakir have always believed and always will. Just as we respect our elders, so do we respect our ancestors. It would be dishonorable to strike them, and might even cause one to be cursed. 
Most people here deem them to be sacred law, not superstition. Even King Faharajad must respect our customs. If he were to ask his people to disrespect their ancestors, his rule would swiftly come to an end. These dark arts are not practiced by our people, but yes, we have experienced the plague of necromancy in the past. Fighting these plagues has always required great sacrifice. Those who have fought the dead have been dishonored, cast out. Most people here deem them to be sacred law, not superstition. Even King Faharajad must respect our customs. If he were to ask his people to disrespect their ancestors, his rule would swiftly come to an end. <laughs> 